Guido. Destroyed. Deconstructed. <laughs> So, I don't even think that I talked to the camera yesterday. I obviously filmed some stuff, but I don't think I even picked up the camera and said hi. Pretty much, I went and just had brunch with Taylor. Then we came, like, had a walk around, came back to mine. Pretty much just chilled and had some wine. And then when Taylor left, Clancy got home. And then we pretty much just cooked dinner, watched TV and all that kind of stuff. And then went to bed. So... I had like a very full day yesterday. I was really tired by the end of it. But yeah, me and Taylor went to brunch. We helped each other get some photos. Had a walk around the city and then came here as well. But yeah, I am now going to go to the gym. And I'm debating whether or not I walk down because it's not that far. Or if I just drive and just like get there quicker and then get home quicker afterwards. I'm thinking it'd be nice to walk purely because I don't have anything else. Like... I have stuff to do today, but I have the day off, so I have all day to do it. So I'm thinking if I did take that extra, like, 15 minutes to walk there, and fifth, not even 15, like, 10 minutes to walk there, 10 minutes to walk back, it would be fine. But it's really cloudy, so I don't want to walk there and then it start raining and then have to walk back in the rain with, like, my headphones and my phone and stuff. So I'm not sure. Although, it's sunny. It's like sunny but rainy but so you guys can see there like oh if it will it's like blue over there but then it's got like these kind of clouds here but it's kind of clearing up so maybe i'll walk well i might walk then but i'm gonna get a move on so that i'm not there too long because i want to be there for an hour but i guess i can kind of cut down on my walk warm up if i'm walking there so yeah already i am off to the gym so Let's go. All right, so I just got back from the gym. As you can see, I'm very red, but I didn't film anything in there because it's actually really busy. There was like heaps of people just doing the machines and stuff, but then the PT had like um like three people that he was like showing how to do things. So then like that was like a big group of people in there. So I didn't really feel like I could film. One, because I don't want to film in front of everybody, but then also two, the more people that are there, the more risk I have of getting people in the video that might not necessarily want. To be filmed whereas like when there's like one or two people you can kind of avoid them but everyone was going everywhere and i literally had like people just literally right behind me when i was doing deadlifts because there was no other room but yeah i just got back um i had my laptop on the charge while i was away so i'm gonna have a shower i'm not gonna do any makeup and stuff because i'm thinking that when clancy works this afternoon i might film a video i'm not sure <sighs> yeah i'm gonna have a shower cool down put on some different clothes because I wore my jumper back because it's obviously good to keep your muscles warm right after a workout but now I am really hot walking home in this big jumper so yeah I'm going to have a shower get dressed and then I'm going to edit what well, the last video that you guys saw and then also this video up until like right now so oh actually before I do that I might make breakfast so yeah anyway Okay, please don't mind the robe, I just tanned. Um, so I had breakfast and then I always like to tan a little bit after my shower so that my skin has time to like dry and the tan does like mix with the water. My face looks really ashy at the moment but I'm only gonna have this on for like an hour and then take it off. But I really wanna quickly show you before I start editing and before Clancy gets home and I don't wanna talk in front of the camera that I went and got a new desk. So now I have 
my own little space. Um, I decorated it all like how I wanted. So I pretty much just went and got, um, well I got the desk from Target pretty much. It's a little bit broken like this de this drawer, it doesn't go in, but we're thinking if we swap the drawers, we'll see, I don't know if it's gonna like make a difference or whatever. I went and got these picture frames from Kmart and then this was when we were in Dublin in 2017. Jesus, that was so long ago. <laughs> um 2017 slash january 2018 and i didn't have a photo big enough for this frame so i literally just took some leaves and like put it <laughs> in there but like that's probably only going to be until i work out something to do but i like the color they all go together and then i got this plant therapy book um just kind of as a table book that's pretty much the only reason i got it i have my little gucci thing um because i thought that would go with it as well this candle we actually got from tj maxx but it smells so good. It's guava and mango. I really love it. Um, if I ever burn it, I'll probably like move it over a little bit just so it doesn't like catch anything on fire. Um, I'm gonna set like my cameras up here because um, they're black and like it'll go with everything. My laptop, my planner, and then just this little piece of lily as well. But yeah, that is what it looks like. I think it is so cute. I just wanted to show you that before I start editing because that's what I'm gonna do now. I'm really not sure what I'm gonna do when I'm finished. I guess we'll, <laughs> we'll see when we get there, but I'm gonna do some editing and I'll check in with you guys later. It's only 4.30 but I'm just going to cook dinner now because I'm just going to put like, so I'm making a lasagna. I'm just going to like cook the lasagna, put it all together and put it in the fridge until it needs to be like put in the oven. So I thought if I get that done now I won't have to worry about doing it later because I was kind of getting the feeling that I wasn't going to be bothered to cook. So if I do it now then it's done. I was going to film a makeup video but me and Clancy are going to an inspection tomorrow. So I'm thinking I might just do it in the morning while he's at work to then go to the inspection because I'm not going out today and it's already like 4.30 so I don't even putting makeup on and then like and then like not go out. I was supposed to go out for dinner with some of the girls to watch the oh I don't even what's it called state of origin or something I don't follow it and I have no interest in rugby whatsoever or league or like whatever it's called but all of the, my friends go like follow it but I honestly don't, don't really give two shits about it <laughs> I was just gonna go and like see everybody but I kind of think I'm just gonna call them and tell them that I can't go just really like money wise <laughs> um, after going out for breakfast yesterday like I don't want to spend any money until I get paid which is not till like it's not till tonight but I normally get paid like it's like the crossover between like Wednesday and Thursday so like it's like midnight kind of a thing so I technically don't have any money till tomorrow and I know that this week is like a little bit of a smaller pay week just because I only had two shifts last week so the week before that's kind of carrying the rest so yeah I'm just gonna tell them that I don't think I'll make it and I want to plan like a full day tomorrow so we're going to an inspection tomorrow pretty much we are looking for a new place mum has got a job so she's gonna be staying with us I think once or twice a week I'm not sure I think it's once a week but she's gonna be putting in um, like just a tiny bit of money to like increase our budget and we're looking for places that have three bedrooms like two or three bedrooms we think three bedrooms would be better so Clancy has booked me and him to go in and see a house tomorrow at like 1 30 I'm pretty sure he said but I'm gonna make this I'm just waiting for the me to defrost I guess I will check in with you guys when that's done and when I'm putting it in the fridge and I'm not sure what I'm gonna do after that we shall see but I'm gonna cook this and I will be back later <gasps> Oh, the nightmare is over. It's okay. Hello? Hey. Are you on uh, your... I'm leaving, I'm leaving now, so I should be able to pick you up on the way. Okay, that sounds good. I'll make okay. sure that I'm ready when you get here. Alright, you're awesome. Okay. Okay, bye. Bye. Good afternoon, everybody. It is almost 1 o'clock. 
I have had a really slow start to the morning. We pretty much like got up, just like ate and chilled and like I was like feeling a little bit like Anyway, I've just filmed this makeup look which will have been already posted so it will be right here if you guys want to check it out. I like how it turned out but it turned out definitely different to what I was like trying to do but oh well. But it's exciting because Clancy just as you guys saw he's going to come pick me up. We're going to a house inspection so I haven't actually mentioned this before and I should probably talk about it while I'm getting ready. Um, Mum got a new job so she's going to be commuting. She wants to stay in Canberra one night just to make like the commuting so she's not commuting every day. One or two nights a week she's going to just stay overnight with us which means we need two bedrooms and we don't want her just like like sleeping on the futon. So we are looking for a new place. We're looking for somewhere with three bedrooms. We have um, mum contributing a little bit of extra money towards our rent which means we can look at some nicer places and bigger places with that kind of increase of budget so we're looking at three bedrooms but we're going to an inspection I don't know if I'll be able to film I might try and do a sneaky film on my phone but actually having a physical camera there is probably going to look a little bit suspicious might do a little sneaky um film on my phone for you guys um but yeah I need to get changed and then Clancy's picking me up but that is what is happening so I will quickly talk to you before or like when we um are on our way okay so I just quickly thought I'd show you I just pretty much chucked on this dress um like beachy summer dress that Clancy's mum bought for me just because it's really easy to like chuck on and it looks nice I'm probably just gonna wear some sandals um it looks windy outside but it doesn't look like hot but I've got a jacket like up over there anyway you guys can see this is going to be my new filming setup like i was saying we're looking for a three bedroom so that we can have a spare room and an office so if we had an office i could have this set up pretty much i'd have like something else to chuck my actual ring light on but i could have this set up pretty much perm like pretty much permanently not have to move it and because obviously it's in the middle of the lounge room at the moment like i have to keep setting it up and I'm like unpacking it up when I film so that we obviously don't use the space up but a three bedroom I could just keep it like this or relatively similar to that and not have to worry about packing it up because it'd be in the office and that would be like work kind of and I'll just turn the desk around if I was doing uni or like move it slightly over but like I would, wouldn't have to like really pack it up which very excited about like Clancy's desk wouldn't have to like be so close like I'm gonna have to move this so that he can use his desk and stuff but yeah you guys know what I mean I'm very excited that that might be a possibility um we are aware that our contract doesn't run out until the end of January so at the moment we're just looking to see like what the space of a three-bedroom apartment would look like yeah we just want to go and check out what what place is going to be like what, what our budget means that we can look at but all of the places are a lot newer than what we have now so we're very excited <laughs> we're very excited to have somewhere really modern new white clean new kitchen all that kind of stuff a dishwasher oh my god we really want a dishwasher that's about it so Clancy's is probably almost here ish and then i guess we'll go and check out this place so let's go <laughs> Okay, please ignore my messy kitchen, but the inspector went well. Um, we got back and then Clancy went to work and then I decided I wanted to go and get some stuff from the supermarket. Um, just some really like little things that we're like running out of. 
But I went to Office Works and while I was in because Office Works is in Fishwick. So while I was in Fishwick, I just went to the op shop. So the designer emporium op shop may have splurged a little bit on this book that I got. So I got it for my desk, but I, I mean I also got it to read, like I'm gonna go through it. But it's more of like a coffee table book. But I went and picked up the Prada catwalk book with like all the runway stuff in there. I saw this and I was like, oh, I, I really want to get it. So I got it. I'm going to spray it with some like what you spray your shoes with so that they don't go all dirty. Just so it doesn't get like fucked up. <laughs> but yeah, I kind of splurged on this. And then I pretty much just got some stuff for uni next semester. I got these folders for notes and stuff. So pretty much what I'm going to do is write down all the lecture notes, take notes in the lecture and print them off week by week and like add photos and diagrams and stuff just to make it a little bit easier for me to read and then put it in here. And then I'll take this to the tutorials so I have all the lecture notes printed out in this. And then me and Clancy for Christmas are going to go halves in an iPad. And we're going to get like one of the newer ones, but like not a really fancy version. Um, but I'm going to get the pen with it. And I'll put a photo here, but I have all these photos of people doing really cool like notes on iPads and stuff. And they're like really neat. So I'm going to do that for the tutorials and then print them out and then put them with the lectures. So I got two of these and then I just got like a little pen holder and I just got some more of my favourite pens because all the ones that I have at the moment are running out. So I pretty much just got some more milk and I got two lots of lifelong milk. I got some two minute noodles to make my meagering noodle on a budget. Some more cheese slices, toasties, just some raspberries so that we always have some kind of fruit as well as some grapes because I took the grapes that I bought last week to Kuma and left them there and I just got more butter because we go through it so quickly. I also just got um, a high fiber leggy I bread from Baker's Delight. Just a little treat to go to the actual bakery instead of just getting bread from Woolies. And then I just got like a Baker's Delight pizza for lunch for me because I could have a lasagna but we're saving that so we don't have to do anything for dinner. But yeah, I'm probably going to pee because I didn't am busting. You probably all really wanted to know that. Put this up, well, I'm gonna put this stuff away first. Then I'm probably going to do some editing, or I'll have lunch, maybe just watch some, watch some YouTube and then do some editing um, in the afternoon. I filmed this morning, like as you guys, as I already mentioned, so I'll probably be editing that video. That is about it for what I got from the supermarket and like when I went on my little splurge spray. And I'll show you my desk once I've put like this on it and the book and stuff, but I'll do that after I've done all this. <laughs> Thank you.